Good Friday, everybody. Here I am trying to get my uh, pellet stove. This is my pellet stove. And it was overflowing. I don't know if you can see it. So I was a good person than I am. I emptied it all out. See, there's a little bucket in there. Yeah, I emptied that old stuff. And took that out. Went to restart it. And now I won't light. I've tried everything. I've tried unplugging it. I've tried... Um, it's... I've tried everything. Does anybody have one of these pellet stoves? Because for some reason mine gives me a hard time when I try to relight it. Now see, I just I just shut it off and I restarted it. This is like the fifth time I've done this. And I'm hoping that we have some smoke and those pellets start to catch on fire. Because I've emptied that bucket like two or three times already. The auger seems to be working. The auger is what feeds the pellets into the bucket. But this is getting frustrating and my husband's not here. And yeah. So, hi, how are you? I look like crap. Sorry about that. Um, I've been working on this for like an hour or two already. Probably even more than that because I had to dump the ashes this morning. And then I get a call from my mother. I'm all congested. I'm like, then go to the doctor. And she starts like almost crying. And I'm like, I have no gas and I'm dealing with the stove. I can't really leave now because it's cold and it's going to be getting colder and this is the only heat I have right now yeah so I don't know she lives like right across from the hospital so if anything if she needs anything boom she can go right across she's like I don't know if I can drive myself oh boy of course you can if not there's always 911 Anyways, yeah, she has COPD. She smokes two packs a day. We've been telling her. She had double pneumonia last year. We've been telling her right along. Slow the cigarettes down. Get on your patches. You know. And I don't want to sound like a hypocrite because, yes, I do smoke. But I smoke maybe two to three packs a week in seven days. She smokes two packs a day, okay? There's a big difference. And when it's cold, I don't go out in the freaking cold. Not, not usually. I'm, I'm not gonna go out there and freeze my tissue off. Anyway, she's high risk. She knew she was high risk and she continued. And uh, I don't have no, what do you call it? I don't have the answer. Go to the doctor. Whatever. So anyways, yeah, I'm trying to deal with the stove. Back to the stove. Okay. My pellets are full. Here, look. It's pretty dark in there. I don't think you can see. Yeah, see? My pellets are all in there. And it's supposed to start smoking. Okay, everybody told me these damn stoves are supposed to be so convenient. So what do we do? We get one of these. Come on, work, you son of a bitch. Sorry. It's definitely frustrating. So, yeah, that's what I'm doing today. What are you doing? Oh, let's see here. Oh boy, wait a minute, I think I see smoke. Come on, baby, work. If we get smoke, it'll be great because that means it's trying to ignite. Come on, work it. 
Anyways, if anybody has one of these uh, pellet stoves, can you leave me a message? Because, uh, yeah, I need some help, apparently. Either that or I just have a lemon. Because we've been fighting this thing ever since we got it. We've only had it for like a week. And I live in a mobile home and I don't know if I'm supposed to have an inspector come in and inspect it or what. So. And a lot of the pellets are junk. I mean, they're all stuck together. They're bigger than they're supposed to be. It clogs up the auger. Yeah. I don't know. I think it's time to get some oil. Next week. We can't do it this week because uh, our electric company was at my door yesterday. Going to shut me off. Unless I gave them the whole check. Which pissed me off. They don't care nowadays if you have kids or not. They want all the money now. No questions asked. I'm like, excuse me? We just made a payment. Well, it's not enough, lady. We want the whole thing. So, yeah. We have very little money this week. Because of that. So, yeah. There's a little rant for you. And I'll let you know if this thing actually works. It better work. My husband ain't gonna be home until later on tonight. And my daughter has a friend coming over. Lovely. Okay guys, this is getting long. Gotta go. Wish me luck. Ta-ta.